them to tell me not to marry Xander. No, no, I, I, I only found out about the wedding last night. I mean, I saw Xander here. He was talking and gloating about how the best man won. And, and I should dump him because... Blunt, as always. Look, okay, Sarah, I have, I have no right to weigh in on your personal life, especially after the way I treated you. So I should just shut up and be happy, but I'm having a really hard time doing that. Because I believe that you and I so belong together. If that's impossible, if you never want to talk to me again, you never want to see me again, that's fine. But just promise me this. Don't marry Xander. Fine. I won't. Sierra was so angry with me about what happened with Trip. Trip? Yeah, when she walked in on us at the loft. That was years ago. I know. I know, but, but the way she was talking... It's like she doesn't remember anything that happened after that. Sierra, how are you doing? Better. Now that Claire is gone. God, I can't believe that she had the nerve to be so kind and friendly after she could do something like that to me. And you're angry with her because... Okay, um... So remember how I told you that Tripp and I were planning on taking things to the next level in our relationship? And every time we'd start, I would pull away because of what happened with Chase. Of course I would. And I encouraged you to be honest with Tripp. I thought that it would bring you closer together. Yeah. And, um, that's what I did. I went over to the loft to talk to him and to tell him the truth about why I broke things off. And when I got there, he and Claire were on the couch together. I, I can't even tell you what it looked like on Kayla. I understand how upsetting this all is. But I just need to ask you, what is the last thing that you remember about Tripp and Claire? Just in general. <sighs> the accident. What accident? When I crashed my bike. That's why I'm here, right? It was just like you said. Come on.